If all I had was Christ, I'd have nothing to gain. All I have is Christ, and I have everything. His presence is enough. He hides me in His wings. He wraps me in His love and stirs my heart to sing. My life is in His hands. He is my confidence. He keeps His promises. Forever and amen. He's gentle with my heart. He knows each tear I cry. There's healing in the scars for everyone of mine. My life is in His hands. Guys, this is really special. Thank you so much for sharing the song. I love this arrangement and the instrumentation. Thanks, man. And it's Thank so you. good. Mm. Thank you. And the recording, I mean, it's it's really raw too. Mm. You know, I mean, like feels like you really just feels like you guys got around like one mic, a couple of instruments. That's pretty much what it is. <laughs> <laughs> I did, yeah. <laughs> but maybe Scott, we'll, we'll start with you to talk about this a little bit. Man, it, this song is so great. Like, it, you know, it reminds me of so many of the old hymns. You know, mm -hmm. the melody for sure, but um, even that scripture, you know, the Philippian scripture for, for me to live as Christ and to die as gain. Yeah. Um, it just comes to my mind when I hear this. But talk about that song, the song a little bit, just the meaning behind the lyric. Yeah. I mean, so this is the second song we ever wrote together as a band. And we wrote it in a closet backstage before we went and led worship, which was, I mean, at least we started it like that, mm -hmm. which was really, you know, kind of crazy. We were, I think we had all had a pretty wild season, just tough on a lot of levels right before we wrote this song. And for me personally, my twins had just been born three months early right before we wrote this and they were in the hospital. And man, I wrestled, I watched them kind of vacillate between life and death for three months. And, you know, I mean, I watched my daughter flatline and be gone for 60 mm -hmm. seconds and then be revived. And so the, the tug of that sort of sent me into a, okay, if I were to lose my children, 
is Jesus really enough for me? If I were to lose my wife, is Jesus really enough for me? And I, I had never been faced with that in my life at that time, you know? And, and then we wrote this song shortly thereafter, and, and everybody here has their own stories for, you know, how it was written. But I think for me, uh, it, has, it has sent me into a dive into my heart to feel like, do I really believe that, you know? And, the, and man, the truth is I do. I know it to be true. And there are days where I wake up and I'm like, oh, man, if I didn't have all this, whatever it might be, my family, you know, uh, I wonder if, if, I would, if I would come to the cross the way that I do if life circumstances are good. Mm. But, man, I know that that is the truth of the gospel. I know it deep down in my soul, and I know that that's why we're all here, you know, because we truly do believe that. And it's kind of crazy. I, when I, I woke up or I came over here today, and I opened my guitar case, and there was this letter from my daughter that she, like, <laughs> posted and noted and said, you're an amazing father. And, and she had put these all over my my office the other day. Like, I, w- I walked downstairs, and they were just posting notes everywhere with words of encouragement. And it made me think, like, okay, if all I had was Christ, I'd have nothing to gain. And he is the perfect father because I mm. am so messed up as a dad, but my daughter still loves me. So what a chance for us to go say, Hey, we have this adoration for an amazing father who is perfect Mm -hmm. and he is all we need. And if we could live our lives, like we believed that, I think it would change the course of how we deal with sorrow and how we deal with pain and how we, like we talked about earlier, you know, embrace those as seasons of life that that we're allowed to walk through, but Mm -hmm. just really know, Hey, there is a firm foundation in the cross and that is it. Wow. So okay. it's been it's been mm. blessing us, you know, to kind of realize that. I think we've learned that as a band more and more in the last wow. several months. And I find it amazing that you're just talking about like songs coming out of a period of struggle like that. You know, there's I think about those old hymn writers. And a lot of those songs just came out of like some like desperate times. Mm. You know, and it's like when we hit that that rock bottom that, you know, we finally, you know, we lift our eyes up, we reach up, and we're able to say those things like, well, if Jesus is all I have, then that's enough, you know. But, man, like out of that experience and out of that hardship, I mean, really breeds these songs that just have a depth of meaning, you know, mm. to them. It's amazing. Yes, yes. Mm. So good. Well, Franny, I think you're going to walk us through what you're playing on yeah. keys over there. So this, this song is in A. And the intro just hangs on the one. And y'all have a little guitar thing. What is it? The dun, yeah. Dun, 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 dun. yeah. And then the verse is, is one. And then it goes to two. Five. Four. One. And that's, that's for all of the verses. And then, then the chorus is two. Five. One. One over three, back to that two, five, and then the one. And then you go back to the verse, and then the bridge, it's, um, I, I play it with the, with a one and then a four in the bass, so it's, it sounds like four, one over four, and then a, is that a five over one? And it's the just one. like a four, five, one, I yeah, think. Yeah, four, five, one, yeah. And then four, five, one. Then the second or the third time it goes four, five, six, one over three, and back to the four, five, one. Something really pretty that I love on the keys mm-hmm. in, in the bridge. So it's uh, the, with the the basic A shape, and then I go. Um, so I have never known a love like this before. That's amazing. You are the one I'm living for. I think that's so pretty. Yes. And I'm, then I remember the first time you played that. Course. I was like, you don't remember that? Oh, and yeah. Upstairs in the, in the Absolutely. hallway. It was so awesome. And then at the after the last chorus, we do a, a tag. So, um, my love is in you. You are my confidence. Keep your promises. We keep your promises forever. And, and then it goes six. Back to the one over three. You keep your four, five, one. And some of those one over threes might actually be a three minor oh. on the record. Some of them are one over threes. You know, either one would work, but. Yeah, I just play the first two notes. So. 
Yeah, and I love the little melody thing at the end. The, the ooh, ooh, ooh. Yes. Oh, that whole yes. section. That yeah. whole section there is just gorgeous, man. Like, oh. I, I feel like you're so much. I mean, we've talked about like yearning songs today, but like that melody, it's just got something in it that's just like, it's that perfect picture of like that looking ahead and mm. just looking ahead to the day when we're with Jesus and like mm. this sort of in between space. But man, yeah. it's so beautiful. Gosh. It's crazy how yeah. instrumental music can bring thoughts mm. like that. Oh, Absolutely. Wild, man. It's amazing. Should we talk about the chords to that section in case people want to play yeah. that? Yeah, let's walk yeah. through that. It's yeah. just so beautiful. Yeah. yeah. So you want to talk? It's, it, well, I don't. It's, I so actually it's, don't. Okay. I was okay. playing that. So, so it's, a, it's a six minor to a three minor to a two minor or excuse me four to a two so six three minor four to the two Then in that time it goes to one over three. My life is Yeah. Wow. Yeah. yeah, you gotta do that section if you're gonna play it in church. Yeah. You gotta do yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Get your cellist and let's go. <laughs> That's yeah. right, totally. Well, thank you guys so much. You, it's been Jimmy. so fun being with you all and I just love this song. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah. My life is in his Confidence, he keeps his promises forever.